Thank you, Skycorn, so much for over 1K subscribers. Hey, Skycorns, it's me, Skylar, and today I'm going to be doing a back handspring tutorial for you, Skycorns. So, I got a lot of requests for my 1K subscriber special video. They were things like jump into a pool full of cold water, do the Never Have I Ever challenge, and the best one yet. Bake a Rosanna Panzino cake, which I really want to do. But today I decided I am feeling in a back handspring tutorial mood. I now have my gymnastics mat because I promised you Skycorns that I would do my back handspring tutorial once I got a mat and I got a mat, so yeah. <laughs> so I'm really excited for this video and I just want to say I thought to myself, 1,000 subscribers, hmm. Back handspring tutorial, what a great way to celebrate 1K, guys, because you Skycorns love my gymnastics and acro dance tutorials, so I was like, what a great way to celebrate by showing you guys how to do a back handspring in one day. <laughs> so without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so the first thing that you need to do in order to get your back handspring in one day while being safe are handstand holds. So this is what a handstand hold looks like. Now, if you can't hold a handstand for that long, I make sure to check out, click the eye up there, my video on how to hold your handstand longer in five easy steps. That video is definitely going to help you hold your handstand longer. So you're going to be doing five of these. Now, in the handstand, I need you to hold it for about two seconds, not as long as I just did. Hold it for about two seconds and then arch and then come down. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like. What I just did was a normal handstand, but this is the drill for how to snap down. So you're gonna go like this. You're gonna do one, two, arch, hit, like that. So you're gonna be arching and then you're gonna snap down like that. The next step is going to be a back bend. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go back bend. I just hit my hand on the wall. <laughs> anyway, you're gonna do back bend and then after that you're gonna kick your legs like this and just come down. You're going to be doing five of these. After you have finished five of those, you're going to be doing an exercise where you're going to be jumping backwards. You're going to have your arms straight up. You're going to sling your arms. You're going to jump arch, just like that. So you're not going to be going all the way back into a back bend. You're just going to start here, swing and jump arch, like that. I recommend doing about five of these. We are almost to the actual back handspring. So the next step is you're gonna be doing five, five back limbers. So you're gonna put your arms up and you're just gonna be like this. You're gonna be doing, as I said, five of these. Why am I so expressive today? So we only need one more step till we actually get to the actual back handspring. So you're gonna have your arms up by your ears and you're gonna go back. You're gonna bend your knees. Don't do this, this is not correct. And don't do this either. Like if you go like this, like that back handspring is not gonna look pretty at all. So you're gonna have your arms up, swing down, and we're gonna be in a neutral position, and then you're just gonna do a fast back lever. As you do more and more of these, you're gonna get more and more comfortable, and then the back handspring's probably gonna come out of it. After you've done a couple of those, now you're ready for the back handspring. Remember to keep your arms straight 
up and reach really tall to the ceiling and make sure to jump backwards and make sure you're in a safe environment and if you need a spot, make sure that you have a spot or you're at a gym or make sure your cat isn't there because you don't want to hurt her. <laughs> and Oh, or your dog, or your dog. Swing backwards, make sure you're jumping back, pretend you're doing a back limber, and sit in a neutral position, and jump. That is what your back handstand should look like. So, I'm gonna do a couple more to show you guys how to do it. Come straight up. Make sure to always swing and sit, and jump, and finish. I really hope you Sky Girls enjoyed this video. Make sure to like it, subscribe to my channel, comment down below, and turn on that post notification bell, which you know is down below. Also, the Sky Corn merch link is going to be down in the description. And I actually just bought my own Skycorn sweatshirt and pants from Teespring. So I am really excited for them to come in the mail. That way I can wear it on my channel. I'm so excited. <laughs> and I can't wait to teach you guys more gymnastics tutorials. Thank you Skycorns so much for over 1K. I am so beyond blessed for you guys. You guys are literally the most amazing Skycorns. And I know, maybe there's not another Skycorn, but you're the best Skycorns out there. So I will see you Skycorns in my next video. Bye Skycorns, we are Unisome.